Okay, our viewer question today is how much salt should we be having daily and is any even necessary? Uh, for the vast majority of folks, uh, no added salt is necessary. The sodium that we're concerned about is in the food. It's in the celery, it's in the veggies, it's in the fruits. You know, we, uh, all food has sodium in it. We don't need extra salt for most people. I've, I've noticed over the years, however, there's a group, they're usually pretty lean vegan folks with low blood pressures. Uh, these folks do better with a little pinch of salt or um, some extra tamari sauce on their on their veggies there. So nine out of 10 people don't need any extra salt at all. About 10% 10, 10 of people might benefit from a little pinch of it. How much do you need? Uh, you want to keep your total sodium intake below 1500 milligrams. Uh, if you're going to be using um, salt at all, you want it added at the table. People say, oh, we got rid of our salt shakers. Actually, that's the place you've got control uh, over the salt in your food. You don't have to, Italian restaurant, you don't have any control over the salt that's already in the spaghetti sauce. But at your, in your own house, you can add your own salt. And if you use a pinch, literally a pinch, there's about 300 milligrams of sodium. Uh, and so if you have three meals a day, you have a pinch, you know, 300, uh, it gets you in the 1,000 to 1,200 milligram range. So yeah, a pinch of salt at the table is, is appropriate. Just avoid the processed foods that already have the salt added in there. But if you, if you don't feel like you need any, you, then you probably don't. Hi, everyone. Dr. Michael Clapper here announcing our new format for our Q&A with Dr. K. Annie Hagen will be asking me one question that's been sent in by our viewers. So if you wanna see if your question is getting answered, do join us for our Q&A with Dr. K right here. Hope to see you then.